All right, let's bring in uh, Jeff back in now and talk about the rest of the, the week. And we got some rainfall. Mm -hmm. How are we doing with that? Uh, we're doing pretty good. You know, we picked up anywhere from a quarter to about one inch. So uh, nice, at least for the short term fire danger. Yeah. When it comes to the rainfall season, though, it really hasn't made a major impact. And we're going to take a look at how we're doing so far for that rainfall season as we start off right now. And uh, you can see the clouds are still lingering. We'll track that rainfall here in a second. Uh, but as we look at that rainfall season, now everybody continues continues to be below average for the rainfall season. So disheartening to see after all of that record setting rainfall we had in October, uh, even for parts of November and December. We're down 6.36 inches in Santa Rosa. Uh, we're down just over a quarter of an inch in Oakland and uh, Concord down 2.26 inches. So on Storm Ranger, our mobile Doppler radar right now, we've got a few areas of spotty rain you can see right here. We're going to zoom in and put a track on it and you can see right around uh, Brentwood, Discovery Bay. We're tracking some moderate isolated heavier pockets moving off to the north. This would continue some rain here in Antioch over the next 30 minutes and could make it out towards Bay Point by 555 tonight. And then over towards the North Bay, Mill Valley with some lingering rainfall. Also down here towards San Francisco, that's moving out towards the Pacific. So all in all, we are on the downward side of this event. You'll see on our future cast here as we roll through tonight, that rainfall just starts to uh, move on out. So by 10 p.m., we're expecting a dry forecast, but we will hang on to the cloud cover for the morning. So you can see as we started off on your Tuesday morning, we'll begin here with 40s across the Bay Area down to 48 in the South Bay. And for your Tuesday morning over San Francisco, 50 degrees with some areas of fog and the East Bay at 47. So that will be the thing we're hanging on to tomorrow is some low clouds and fog, maybe some isolated drizzle. But then as we roll through the afternoon, we'll clear it out to some sunshine. And it's going to be a really nice day for us. So that means temperatures tomorrow are going to warm up. We're going up about four to seven degrees. So down here across the South Bay, it's going to put us at 66 in San Jose and down to Gilroy 68 over to the East Bay. We're staying in the 60s as well from Antioch out to Oakland and the peninsula. I got you out of Chile 55 and Half Moon Bay, Redwood City 64 San Francisco 59 in the mission. Let's take it off to the North Bay 68 in Santa Rosa 70 in Clear Lake and back here to Napa 67. No more rain coming in that seven day forecast. In fact, we'll see a warming trend San Francisco by Saturday. It's going to be up to 67 degrees. So already looking ahead towards that weekend. We're going to be shaping up good for you right here through the inland valley 68 tomorrow 72 Thursday and here we go 77 on Saturday's forecast and we'll hang on to some low 70s into Sunday and Monday. Now, you know, at least the temperatures are going to stay steady if we're not getting any more rainfall. So thankfully no 90s or 100s. We have seen that this time of the year, so yeah. this is kind of a nice, uh, you know, stride for us next couple of days. Yeah, no, it was it was a kind of a dramatic change to wake up this morning. I know it that much cooler than yeah. it's been in, in a while. It's like winter was back for it's a little back. bit. Back, all right. Thank you very much. You Jeff. got it.